everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Lou, your friendly neighbourhood financial advisor and today we're diving into a topic that's super important but often gets overlooked, income protection insurance. Think about it, we all work hard to build a life we love but what happens if illness or injury strikes and you can't bring home the bacon? That's where income protection comes in. It's like a safety net that catches you if you fall, financially speaking. Let's face it, life can be unpredictable. Accidents happen, illnesses develop, and while we might think it won't happen to us, the reality is it's more common than you might think. In 2022, an estimated 185.6 million workdays were lost due to sickness or injury. That's the highest level on record. Now, some folks rely on sick pay or government benefits, but these might not be enough to cover your bills, mortgage, or that dream holiday you've been saving for. Imagine the stress. Income protection steps in and provides a regular monthly income, replacing a portion of your salary so you can focus on getting better, not your finances. Maybe you're thinking income protection isn't for me, but hold on. It's not just for high powered CEOs. Anyone who relies on their income to live comfortably needs it. That's most of us, from freelancers to self-employed folks to young professionals. Income protection offers peace of mind. Think about your dependents. If you have a family who relies on your income, income protection ensures they're taken care of even if you can't work. But it's not just employed people who should seriously consider income protection. Income protection for stay-at-home parents is often overlooked, but it's surprisingly important for several reasons. Stay-at-home parents provide a tremendous amount of unpaid labour. Childcare, housework and managing the household are all valuable tasks that would cost a significant amount if outsourced. If the stay-at-home parent is unable to manage childcare or housework due to illness, the family would need to hire replacements. These costs can be significant and quickly strain the budget. The working parent might even need to cut back on their work hours or stop working entirely to care for the children and manage the household. This directly impacts the family's income. Income protection helps maintain the family's financial security during a difficult time. Bills can still be paid and the family's lifestyle isn't disrupted as much. The financial safety net allows the stay-at-home parent to focus on getting better without the added stress of worrying about finances. Income protection for stay-at-home parents is an investment in the family's financial security and overall well-being. It recognises the valuable contributions stay-at-home parents make and helps ensure the family can weather unexpected storms. Now, income protection isn't one size fits all. Here are some key factors to consider when choosing a policy. The amount of cover. This is the percentage of your income that will be replaced if you can't work. The deferred period. This is the waiting time before you start receiving your benefits. The benefit payment period. How long will the policy pay out for? Exclusions. Be sure you understand what's not covered by the policy. Trying to navigate the world of income protection on your own can be confusing. That's where a financial advisor like me comes in. I can help you to understand your needs and risk factors, compare different policies and find the best fit for you. Walk you through the application process. Remember, Income protection is an investment in your future security. Don't wait for something bad to happen before you take action. If you're interested in learning more about income protection and how it can benefit you, leave a comment below or shoot me a message. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more financial planning tips. Thanks for watching.